Hello, people of Earth. Um, today what I'm going to be showing you is how to reverse audio in GarageBand. Um, one thing I'm going to double check really quick is just to make sure that I am in the correct version of GarageBand, which is 10.1.4. Um, I had some comments on an old version of a video that said that you couldn't do this anymore. So I updated GarageBand and I double checked and you still can do it. So uh, this is how you're going to do it. Um, if you have multiple tracks, then you're just going to want to solo the track that you want to reverse or that section you want to reverse. You can either select the region or actually select the region. Um, and then what you're going to want to do is you want to go up to share, export to disk, that section, and we're going to export it as an MP3. You can really go either way. I wouldn't, yeah, anyway, it doesn't really matter. Um, I'm just going to call this piano rev, like reverse and export it. Just going to bounce that out and I'm going to grab that and bring it right back into GarageBand. And now we have that and I'm going to solo that. Hopefully that's not feeding back. Um, and right here, right in the button says reverse playback. Boom. You do that. Done. You have a reversed track in my case is piano. And that's it. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments, like if you learned something, and I'll see you next time. Yeah.